Hello everybody, there's a rock gaming here, and we're back for another round of Robocop Rogue City. And after duking it out with Ed209, I'm curious to see who we're going to be duking with next. And speaking of Ed209, uh, what are my objectives? No objectives. Alright. Ooh. Thanks for the chip, buddy. Yep. This is where all Ed 209s need to be in pieces. And just left there. Oh yeah, I got upgrades. Mm. Ooh, scoop that. Not one detection. Okay, a motherboard. Oh, my. Yep, see that? All those back. Yeah, I dig this loadout. by now. Officer Cecil will gather Briggs' belongings and deliver them to the family. They asked for a small funeral, so I expect everyone to give the family space. Briggs was one of us. We should at least do something to honor him. Best thing we can do is get those butchers that did this to him. I want to see everyone in the briefing room in ten minutes. Now back to work! Hey, Murphy. You've been to the hospital, haven't you? How's Lewis? Unconscious, but stable. <sighs> She'll pull through. I'm sure of it. It's time to hold OCP accountable. This can't keep happening. Relax, Kaplan. He's not wrong. How many more of us have to end up in the hospital or a morgue before we do something? It's like Sarge said, we need to get the guy who did it, so maybe let's focus on that? Speaking of which, there's someone who might know something. There's a guy in the jail that wants to talk to you, Robo. Yeah, all right. See you later in the briefing room. Although I do question the cops wanting revenge because they're now already took care of it too all night. Welcome back, Robo. You have a minute? Oh. First of all, I wanted to say I'm sorry that I hesitated back at that steel mill. I already filed a report on the incident to Mr. Becker. Fucking right. As I was writing it, I'd noticed a lot of opportunities to better myself. But considering that was our first mission together, it wasn't all bad, right? Well... There are plenty of places to improve. That's actually something I wanted to ask you about. I've been getting to know different aspects of being a cop, and there's one thing that I keep underperforming at. Shooting. Would you mind showing me how you practice at the range? 
Yes, practice makes perfect. Let us not waste any more time. You want to go now? <laughs> yeah, great. Let's go. <laughs> I don't know if uh, Ro Robo is a good, a good example for target practice. Because, you know, he's a machine. I love the smell of this room. Should we start? First, I want to watch you practice. Oh, this is going to be so... Can... Can I come in now? No. I can't help myself. That was awesome. We are not yet. Right. This has to be some sort of rap. It is not. Oh. Oh my god. Did you see that? Oh yeah. Flash ring up. <laughs> I forgot the other nine shoots multiple bullets. I thought it was part of the chips. Shoot. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Taking notes, Junior. Darn it. I took so many notes. Next time, do it quietly. Eliminate distractions. Being overeager is one of them. Ah, so that's the actual lesson. Now I get it. Is your service weapon properly prepared? I was issued this old gun and serviced it according to the manual. I will try it out. Sure thing. There you go. Service weapon is broken. Yeah. I calibrated it. I did everything the manual said. It is beyond repair. They must have issued it to you by mistake. Huh. I don't think that's entirely true. Other cops give me a hard time because Mr. Becker hired me to monitor you. But I guess that's the way it has to be. A cop must be ready. Get a different gun. Sure. Thank you, Robo. Huh. Any other side missions? No. Alright. Back to the locker. Ah, there's my favorite law enforcement officer. What are you doing here, Pickles? Why are you in this cell? I come here to think sometimes, and the food is better than in the soup kitchen. <laughs> nah, Pickles is cool. That is resourceful. Why, thank you. I try very hard to not try at all. But seriously, I was hoping to see you. I heard what happened to Briggs. After everything he did for me, I'll do whatever I can to help you catch that Wendell guy. He seems pretty good at pitting people against each other. Maybe I'll find some of his dissatisfied customers who'd be willing to talk to me. It could be dangerous. You kidding? On the streets, I'm a samurai. Well, with Briggs dead, it probably makes me more of a... You are not a ronin. <laughs> yeah, okay. Just remember, if you need anything, I'm your guy. <laughs> yep. Me and Robo were thinking the exact same thing. 
Why am I always the one that has to do it? It's not fair. What happened? What is it, officer? Huh? Uh, oh, I, 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 I didn't realize I was talking out loud. It's just that I need to hang Briggs's picture on the memorial wall. It's just a lot. Hey, would you be so kind and help me? All you have to do is find Briggs's photo in the database and print it out. Just make sure to hang it straight. Otherwise, I won't hear the end of it from Sarge. No. There you go, Briggs. Thanks, Murphy. I still need to go get his stuff, so... You know, I'm gonna take care of the desk, but could you get his belongings from his locker? You can put everything in the box. I'll make sure his family gets it. You know, I usually do all of this alone, and it doesn't get any easier no matter how many times I do it. But having you share this responsibility with me, it actually helped. Thank you, Murphy. I hate to be in his shoes in real life. I mean, what he does. Ugh. It'd be definitely a punch to the gut every time. Yep. Uh, okay. We're good. Thanks to Robocop's insubordination, we finally have something concrete. At your service. Wendell Antonowski struck a deal with the street vultures at Highland Park. A place where, for some reason, we weren't supposed to go. Be that as it may, we're on the lookout for anyone from this biker gang. We also know what he's looking for. Yeah, dead bodies. Dead bodies whose brains are still intact, to be precise. Wow, that's even more messed up. Why would he need them? We'll get to the wise, but for now, we need to focus on catching Spike. He's our connection to Wendell Antonowski. Since they know we're onto them, I'm expecting them to be in hiding. They're not hiding. Put on Channel 9. What in the hell? I repeat, OCP Bank is being robbed by the notorious street vultures. We'll keep trying to get closer for a better view. Oh! 
All right, everyone back up. I want you all to be at SWAT's disposal. Sergeant, am I back on the case? I don't think Becker will give me grief if I let you go save OCP's money. You're reinstated. Everyone, move out! Yeah, let's go. Oh, come on. Oh, look at that. One of the cops was actually bothered to show up. No need, SWAT's got it covered. What is the situation? Vultures came up with the great idea of robbing the OCP bank. They've got hostages, and they claim there's a bomb. They must be crazy to think that OCP will just let them leave with their money. Was there any sighting of Spike? Not yet. But I'm sure they wouldn't pull such a stunt without their leader. What is the plan? Let me make this clear. It's SWAT's plan. You're no part of it. Then you are going to need a new plan. You tell him. That Snoopy reporter again. You're gonna get shot. With this buggy brain of yours, you think you still remember how to put the heat on them scumbags? I prefer to serve justice cold. Yeah. I'd much rather trust my toaster with a loaded gun with one bullet already in the chamber than trust those at 209s. Find a way to get past it. 
Try finding the weakest spot in the wall around the gate and breach through that. Uh, any collectibles by any chance? I don't get why there's this Robocop and OCP. Is it OC is it Robocop OCP? Doesn't the score irrelevant? Oh no! Oh yeah, I gotta think of my perks. I gotta have perks. Bridge. Oh no, oh no, oh no, no, that's my score, don't hurt them, they're my score. They don't stand a chance. Oh no, 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 fall behind, I want them, I want them, they're mine. No, 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 no ketchup. No ketchup. I got this. I got this. Don't act like you're all that impressive. With all that fancy tech, a brick would know how to shoot. Yeah, stay salty. Collectibles. <laughs> Do I can't do will? Oh, I'm play with the hanging cannon. It's in here. Ooh. Stay salty. Robocop, I've received information that the bank manager is held hostage in the vault. Where exactly is it? Find the manager's office and we'll go from there. It's at the far end of the office area. Letter to be Frank and Dre in the envelope is the letter I maintain. Please frame it for me so I can keep it on my desk. I still can't believe that our noble founder wrote that letter to personally thank me for 25 years of my faithful service managing this bank. What a great man! Yep, what a great man indeed. He gave me some boost. Give me an XP boost. Mm. Yeah. Hello? Your presence here is unauthorized. Oh, the reporter. So is depriving thousands of people of a roof over their heads. But OCP doesn't seem to mind that. Explain. 
Delta City, a heaven on earth that OCP plans to build in place of old Detroit? A city of the future where there is no crime or poverty. Do you believe the commercials? No. I am working on the no crime part. Then OCP may become the object of your attention soon. In order to create Delta City, OCP must first get rid of people who live in old Detroit. Now that's a topic I'd rather do a story on than you glitching. OCP offered these people investment in the project. The value of their property would cover the cost of entering the business. The later gains will far outweigh the cost, supposedly. You do not believe that. It's OCP. There must be a catch, and I think I found it. The documents say something about additional costs. I believe that's a loophole that OCP placed in order to scam people out of their homes. That is only suspicion. And I need time to prove that my suspicion is true. Time and some of these documents I found. If you detain me, the SWAT jerks will requisition them. Mm. You can go, but if you continue to disobey the law, you will be detained. Maybe I should have treated you more like a police officer than OCP's property. Anyway, the city owes you, and I owe you too. I can see you've reached the manager's office. Great. Now look for a switch that unlocks the doors that lead to the vault. If I'll now, take the doors behind the desk and turn left. The way to the vault should be open now. She <laughs> run about need to destroy a lot of housing. Robot Robocop 3 was the result of that. I will not contribute to depriving my grateful employer of his hard earned savings. We're opening this vault with or with it. No, you won't. Shoot, I want this. I knew our founder would send his best. We're not done yet. Mr. Becker, you're, you're still alive. I only played dead so I didn't end up like you, with a bomb strapped to my body. Robocop, you have to defuse it. The explosion could cause the company enormous losses. Oh no. An opportunity for an ambitious officer. I'll be watching you from a safe distance. You do officer that. Washington, I am looking at a ticking bomb. A, a bomb? Okay, uh, I'm passing you through to the bomb squad. There is no time. I will need your help to defuse it. Gosh, I mean, I, I'll do my best, but, but just give me a moment. First aid, kidnapping. Are you looking for a bomb defusing chapter in the police manual? Found it. <laughs> Call qualified personnel. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Tell me what you see. A thingy with a thingy. Attached to another thingy. Four cables, green, two reds, and blue. Four cables? Got it. It is a C4 explosive and seems to be homemade. Yeah, that's what I'd expect from the street vultures. Four connectors with different voltage. What's the highest voltage? 24 volts. Cables lead to the fuse. Does the fuse appear to be electronic? Affirmative. Okay. So they used this kind of bomb before. According to the diagram, you should detach three cables. Start from the one with the highest voltage, then proceed down one at a time to the one with the lowest voltage. There are two different color 12 volt cables. Which one do I detach first? Uh, okay, maybe this isn't the time, but I'm colorblind. Oh, dear Lord. There is one way to be sure. 
I will safely detonate the bomb. So, you could have done that straight away? I thought you may learn something here. Yeah, what he said. It was just a minor incident. Ready to get back to business? Because I need to make a withdrawal. Like, now. Well, I should really check upstairs. Nonsense. This is OCP. Money comes first. Now, open the vault. Th there you go, sir. Great. Now out of my way. It took everything. What the hell is this? Where is all the money? Our founder has most of our capital tied up in a very ambitious and resource heavy project. Uh, I can't believe old man's blowing all of OCP's money on Delta City. Have some respect, young man. Back with the money in the next We're leaving. You should be proud to work for such a great man. At this rate, soon there might be no one left to work for him. See what I'm talking about? I'll save these for the it two on nine. Yep, still don't trust it. Snitch. Oh, it's just a grenade. Pursuit of the remaining bikers through the tunnel. So that's how they must have gotten here in the first place. It seems they're retreating into the old industrial area. That must be where they've hidden their getaway vehicle. You gotta hurry. Oh. Oh, 
get you. Now I'm gonna get you. Yeah, come here. Ah, oh, you don't wanna get grabbed. Fine, you can blow up. I'm gonna check for collectibles. Be right back. I cry. I didn't find nothing. Out of men, Spike. What the... Now I've only we had that 50 k from the movies where just one shot and everything explodes please let that gun be in this game i'd be a happy person if that was that true i am listening creep robocop why did wendell antonowski send you here this was a suicide mission we no longer deal with that arrogant prick we had an agreement we held our end of it and apparently it slipped his mind to pay us for our services. Well, that didn't sit well with us, so now we're out to get what we're owed. The only thing you are owed is a prison cell. Yeah, I don't think so. I'm a vulture. I need my space. I'll see you around, cop. the attack, we all thought our money would be safe at the OCP bank. Yeah, glad we got Murphy on our team. I have 
pertinent information regarding the case. We'll get to that, Murphy. But right now, it's time for your psych evaluation. Becker will chew my ear off if I don't make sure you take part in it. So go. Dr. Blanche is already waiting in the observation room. Once it's over, join us in the briefing room. Yay. What's the big idea? What? Piece of junk taser blew the fuse when I tried to charge it. Any excuse to get away from shrink duty. Robocop, is that you? I can't see anything. I am standing in front of you, Officer O'Neill. Is there a problem? Oh, see, P skimps on everything when it comes to the police. Fired our maintenance guy to reduce their costs, so now we are literally in the dark. We need to get the power back on. I am equipped to deal with such situations. Yep. Follow the cables. They should take you to the fuse box. Uh, how do I do Robo Vision again? Oh, yeah, duh. I gotta do it manually. Hey. Shining beacon of hope. Thanks for the help, Murphy. No problem, me too. I should take my time. Oh, let's see what we got. We are going to build a brand new city where Detroit now stands. Delta City is the only hope that we have. No so it wasn't I'm ready for you, Robo. Sent us insulated gloves. I'm afraid not. Looks like OCP is really cutting costs where it can. God knows what they'll cut next. Or who. Hey, what's that look supposed to mean? All right. Let's see what's cooking under the hood. Once I'm done, he's all yours, Doctor. Oh. Ah. Uh, oops. I should have looked more thoroughly. Yep. I deserve it. Hello, Murphy. Congratulations. I've seen your accomplishment on TV. I hope that I'll manage to remain professional despite sitting opposite a celebrity. How do you feel about being acclaimed as a hero again? It helps if the criminals know that they should fear me. I suppose it makes your job easier. 
I'm sure you'd love to share this accomplishment with Anne Lewis. You've seen her at the hospital, haven't you? How is she? She is stable. You cherish that relationship, don't you? She's an important part of your life. Your past life, too. She is. Just like your family. You're very protective of your past. OCP cut me off from my family. And how do you view their decision to separate you from them? Hmm. It was cruel. To everyone involved, I'm sure. Nevertheless, you still think about them, don't you? What comes to mind when you try to remember your family? I see. Memories can be painful. Especially when they're connected to the ones you love. They tend to remind us of what we're missing. The thief that broke into my house I mentioned before. He was my brother. He was an addict who'd come over to steal things to sell so he could buy drugs. As you can imagine, my last memory of us together is not a happy one. But despite that, I still wouldn't want to lose it. It serves as a reminder of how I failed him. And I've been trying to rectify it ever since. I do not remember my family. I can only feel them. These feelings, how do they manifest themselves? as echoes of the past. But OCP sees them as obstacles that need to be removed. And now you're afraid that they sent me here to convince you they are right? Did they? What you need to understand is that regardless of outside influences, my client's well-being takes highest priority. Especially now that I understand how important these memories are to you, I will fight for you in every way I know how. If you let me. I think this is a good place to end this session. Thank you for your honesty. It certainly has been noted. I've got plenty to think about for now. All right. This will be the end of episode four. Stopping a big job, somewhat screwing up because I forgot the side mission. Vulture's got left to dry. And as for the missing rings, no clue. But maybe next episode we'll sh shed some light. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe for the next episode. Man, this is getting good. I'm enjoying it. Until next time, this is Desert Rock Gaming saying goodbye and have a great day.